March has been designated National Colorectal Cancer Month. It is the second leading cause of cancer death here in Canada. And in the month of March alone, across the country, more than 1,700 people will be diagnosed with it. And it's going to kill some 700 people. But it is something that can be prevented and treated. And to that end, a contest to raise awareness of the disease. Kate Wallace is with the Colorectal Cancer Association of Canada. Welcome. Thank you. So this contest is kind of your, your baby, I guess. And you know, it's, it's interesting because colorectal cancer is just one of those cancers that people just really aren't very comfortable talking about. Right? Really, it's, I think, the final frontier in our comfort level. I think we've become very comfortable with, uh, you know, urging our mom to go for her mammogram or going ourselves. And colorectal cancer screening is still something that, you know, people just want to put those blinders up and just aren't comfortable talking about yet. So you've used a lot of humor. Now, you, you ran the contest last year. I think we want to take a look at the, uh, the winning entry from last year. Right. And I guess that's the kind of thing you there's also I think a, a print ad as well that uh, that the that you you brought as a winning entry. And I guess that's the way to get the message across, right? To make people laugh about it and and just feel a little more comfortable with the whole concept in general. And really that's why we're reaching out especially to young people and saying, you know, how would you get someone to talk about a below the belt disease? Um, be it humor or comfort. This is and this, that's pipes. the winning uh that's a that's a great ad too. Well, I think it's a good it's a good analogy. You know, if if your sink was leaking, would you <laughs> would you leave it or would you go get someone to check it out? Treat your body with the exact same respect you'd treat your kitchen sink with. So the the contest runs until the end of this month. You're waiting for submissions to come in. Absolutely. And there are cash prizes for this, right? Twenty five hundred dollars for it's, the video. Uh, Fifteen hundred. Yes. And there are three categories. You mm -hmm. can enter all three of them. So there's up to four thousand five hundred to be one. And you can do a print entry, a radio entry, or a video entry. I think the video, the video entries are really kind of what's getting the most, the most exposure right now. So because the bottom line is, it's just a matter of getting screened. Absolutely, right? it's about making lifestyle choices, especially when you're younger, and as you get older, getting screened as well. And getting older is one of the issues, right? Because I guess they don't really know what the causes are, but getting older, being above 50. Is, is a risk factor. Absolutely. Over 50, you are at a higher risk. We do see it in younger people, and if you are experiencing symptoms especially, it's something that you have to be very persistent with your healthcare professional about, because um, we're seeing it happen more and more in younger people. And, and younger people are also in a wonderful position where they can start making some lifestyle choices that will greatly reduce their risk factors. And it's, it's all the standard ones, right? Better diet, exercise. Exercise, eat well, and know your own body to be able to, to notice any subtle changes, for example, in you know, your bathroom habits or your weight, things like that. Okay, so people who want information on the contest itself, or if they want more information on prevention and awareness and symptoms, and there is a website, it's very simple, colorectal-cancer.ca, it's on the bottom of your screen. And thank you so much for coming in. Thank you very much. And good luck in the contest. Thank you.